If you have been following my channel for some time, you might have noticed that I use few tools a lot. LM Studio is one of them. I use LM Studio to run models locally when I am using graphical user interface in Windows, Linux or any other operating system. The reason why I use LM Studio is this because it is quite easy to use, then it is quite convenient to fit in my screen, plus it is also quite fine and nice to present the demos which I do using various benchmarks in maths, English, reasoning and that sort of stuff. You might also have noticed that I sometimes play around with some of the parameters to adjust the speed and the quality of responses. In this video, there are two purposes. One is to show you what exactly I use to speed up the inference in LM Studio and also to introduce you to a new model which is Llama 3 70 billion. The reason why I have selected the 70 billion model is that first we will just run it vanilla after downloading it in LM Studio and you will see that the response will be quite slow. And then I will apply some of the parameters and configurations to speed the response up. Now here I will be using LM Studio again and I want to give a big shout out to one of the viewers of my channel, our friend uh, Ivan Lefever, I hope that I am pronouncing his name right. So he um, provided me some of the parameters and configuration which he uses and I have tried it out on few of the models and I can tell you that they are very very helpful. So I will also be um, putting in those values plus I will also be describing those values. So heads off to Ivan Lefever for reaching out and being so generous of sharing his learning so and really i want to share this thing with all of you that look it's not that i am just um, you know sharing my knowledge or teaching you guys that is not at all we are just here for learning as you can see in the welcome video of my channel the purpose of this channel is to learn i am also learning you are also learning and so that is why i really beg you request you to please comment as much as possible, share your learning, share your knowledge. If you are working on any project, please share it with us and I will be very happy to review it. You might have noticed that I review a lot of tools on the channel which are just bubbling, evolving and they are not even fully functional but still I cover them because we are all part of this AI community. We need to contribute, we need to um, share our learning, share our knowledge because everything is so new. I mean, I have just started doing it for the last one year or so, maybe uh, 18 months, not even 18 months, 16 months, I would say. Um, and we are all learning. Uh, I haven't got any PhD. I am just a student. Uh, so please, please share with me your learnings. I'll be very grateful, very obliged. Um, you know, if you would be doing that. So again, Thank you, Evan, for sharing your knowledge and your configuration here, which I will be using for this video. Now, uh, before we do that, let's have a quick look at what exactly this model is. So this model is Higgs Llama 3 70 billion. If you don't know what Llama 3 is, Llama 3 is one of the models which we have covered a lot on, on our channel. Llama 3 was released few days back and this is one of the finest model um, and this model has been released by Meta. It is quite famous for its openness, inclusivity and helpfulness plus the quality is quite good. And this Hex Llama 3 70 billion is a fine tune of Llama 70 billion and it is specially quite um, agile for role playing while being competitive in general domain instruction following and reasoning. Also, they have performed supervised fine tuning with their in house instruction following and chat data sets. And afterwards, they have constructed preference pairs with a semi automated pipeline that relies on both human labelers and their private LLMs. They have also conducted iterative preference optimization to align the model. And during alignment, they have adopted a special strategy to align the model's behavior with the system message. So, Let's check it out again. I am just going to use my trusted LM Studio, which I always use. I have typed hex here. Let me make this screen a bit bigger. Okay, so I have typed hex in the LM Studio, and 
press enter and there are few of the quantized version because it's a 70 billion model i can't even run it whole now before i proceed any further let me give a huge shout out to mast compute who are sponsoring the vm and the gpu which i'm using for this video the gpu is nvidia rtx a6000 with 48 gb of vram if you are looking to rent a gpu on affordable prices i would highly recommend them and i will drop the link to their website in video's description plus i'm going to put a coupon code of 50 percent discount which you can use readily so highly recommend it now this is lm studio which i'm going to use and if i go down i have just downloaded a biggest quant available which is around i guess i downloaded barto whiskey i guess let me see. yeah so this is the one which i am still downloading it is a q4km and normally i go with q5km but you see it is too large for this machine so i'm just going to go with this 42.52 gb of uh, file which is still q4km so this is a big huge model which i'm going to download and then i will load it on our uh, system and then we will play around with it first i will use it as vanilla we will see what the response is and then we will try to speed up the response with the help of some of the parameters so let's see how much it has downloaded so it has downloaded now it is validating the file integrity shouldn't take any long so let's wait for it to finish and while it is validating uh, the integrity let me quickly show you the video where ivan mentioned these um, helpful uh, configuration item so this was a URL 70 billion when I was doing this is the one this is a um, very gracious and uh, you know viewer who has put it in this so if anything goes wrong blame him not me I'm just kidding so really thank you for this favor okay so let's go back I think we already have downloaded it there you go so it's already completed let's let me show you the file this is a file as you can see let's click on these three dots and then let's load the model by just clicking it here because it says that it is not working with it do i need to what the heck is happening here maybe it is too big i guess yep it's too big that is not good let me try to reduce the size of the layers otherwise i would have to download another model okay so i'm just going to i think i would have to download another model this is too big yeah it's too big you know what let me download another 70 billion model and we will play with it maybe i will go with the url one so instead of that i have just gone and selected this chai fighter model 20 billion this is still a big model and quite a uh, i should say great model for role playing but instead of Llama 3, this is mainly a Franken version of Mistral 20 billion model. And it is quite good at creativity, coherence, and cognitive thinking. And if you are stuck between 13 billion and 30, 34 billion, this 20 billion makes a lot of sense. And then um, it is again a fantastic model, which I was planning to do anyway. So let's try it out in this one. And then we are going to do some role play and all that stuff. But the real purpose of the video is to just check out how the lm studio inference can be speed up with these parameters so let's download this model again launch the lm studio just type chai fighter here press enter and then once you press enter you will see a lot of people already have done the quantization so i already have downloaded the biggest quant which i always go for the q5km as you can see this one the size is around 14 gig it is almost downloaded it is just checking the validity of it so let's wait for it and then we are going to load it and then play with it okay so the model is downloaded let's click on these three dots and then let's select this chai fighters let's wait for it to load now model is loaded let's first ask it a question so i'm just asking it to write 10 sentences ending with the word beauty let me press enter and you see that it is taking long time you can see it we are waiting i will let it run sorry for just empty screen but we i'm just want to show you that how after running like this in vanilla format and then after changing uh, some of the configuration parameters the speed improves a lot so you see 
it's quite slow i will let it run for a bit maybe one or two sentences so that you will be able to see the clear difference hopefully yeah but by the way the answer is pretty correct and if you have been following my channel you might know that most of the channels get it wrong they don't some even fail to even respond with one sentence ending with the word beauty let's wait for this one this sentence to finish this one is also good okay so you can already tell that it is quite slow now i'm just clicking on stop generating now first step i always try to do is to make sure that on the right hand side click on choose options the preset if it's a llama model go with llama 3 if it's a mistral model just search with any mistral um, preset so i just selected the mistral instruct now another thing is to offload it to gpu so just select this checkbox gpu offload and try to offload everything to gpu so that is done another thing as you remember that um, evan mentioned that we should uh, set the temperature uh, set this temperature to maybe 11 let's do it and then tokens to generate minus one which is already set there and then you can just click on this inference parameter so top there is a top case sampling which is triple one and then repeat penalty which is 11 or is it or is it 1.1 okay and then i think it will be 1.1 anyway minimum minimum sampling is i'll just go with 11 and then top p sampling is what is top p sampling is this triple one and then repeat penalty is also 11 okay and then i think this is cool and let's reload the model i'm just reloading the model let's wait for it and let me clear the chat from here too we will ask the question again so let's wait for it and that is done let me ask the question again let me enter it and as soon as i have pressed enter you can see the speed you see how good the speed is and it has uh, continued from three and four because we already did the two one you can say regenerate there you go it is regenerating it how good is that look at the infant speed and without any timer without any wristwatch or sp uh, speed watch you can tell the difference just by setting these parameters so that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it i'm not going to uh, you know uh, do a role play in this one with this model maybe i will do another video because uh, this is already pretty long video but all in all uh, i think model is quite good i'm pretty tempted to test it more but i will do it in a, another video so now you know how to speed up the inference in lm studio if you have any trick up your sleeve please share it in the, in the comment and i would be very happy to you know embed it and of course credit uh, you in that video thanks again and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed please do me a personal favor and at least share it among your friends and contacts thanks for watching